Hi, Jackson with you at FreeGuitarMentor.com and today we're going to work on the song named the same as the artist, Bo Diddley, 1950s uh, classic, and it features the Bo Diddley beat. Now this song itself was covered by many artists including Buddy Holly, uh, Bob Seger, um, The Grateful Dead, Janis Joplin, uh, just a great tune to perform live and because it has that Bo Diddley beat. Bo Diddley was one of the first artists to bring true African rhythms to R&B music. So, um... Very rhythmic. Uh, and apparently the technique is a technique called jambone, which is a, a slapping and tapping kind of... That kind of thing slapping and tapping, and uh, Bo Diddley using that. Great stuff, uh, and great to perform live on stage. If you look around, and I have, you'll see that uh, this song has been performed in the key of G, in the key of F sharp, in the key of F, uh, and the lyrics are almost never the same twice, but I'm gonna give you the lyrics as recorded in the 50s, and I'm gonna, we're gonna work in the key of E. Because I think it's a fun key to work in. I think you'll have, uh, you'll think you'll enjoy that key. Okay, here's Bo Diddley. All right. Well, let's spend a moment on this uh, strumming pattern and rhythm because that's that's it. This is a song about rhythms, and all the guys that have borrowed this and made other hit songs, hit songs out of other songs have used this rhythm very successfully. Um, going to hit down and then down up so down and then down up quickly down down up and then another up down 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 up up down Down, down, up, up, down. Down, down, up, down. And then to finish it off, the little triplet there is up, down, up. Up, down, up. Put those two bits together. Okay, got that. That's uh, that's that's a basic. That's real good. Now there's um, another little thing that he does. And uh, that is in a lot of the versions, usually with lots of tremolo. As far as this hand goes, that's played with a bar, a high bar E chord in the A formation, down to a D. Goes with... Okay, now you need two chords for this song. It's really one chord that's sort of modified into the second chord, and that is E major. But really, we're only going to strum down on the first four notes from top down, the sixth, fifth, fourth, and third strings. We're probably not going to bother with the B and the E string. So I am going to play that A. 
but I'm going to leave uh, this finger on the B note and, and then play the A by fanning down, flattening out my pinky finger to make an A chord. Using that strumming pattern we, we worked on earlier. Okay, let's put a bit of the song together along with some lyrics. Uh, I guess I'll put that on the screen, although it really is not, there's not much to remember in terms of chord changes. Basically, it's that E to A. Baby diamond ring And if that diamond ring don't shine He gonna take it to a private eye And if that private eye can't see He better not take the ring from me singers will do this. Definitely. But that's that's it. It's all about rhythms, folks. That African rhythm, the Jambone rhythm, the 50s, and the amazing Bo Diddley. Here on FreeGuitarMentor.com.